the Tampa Bay Lightning have won the Stanley Cup again and are now back-to-back champs. And with what I guess you could say is the more things change, the more they stay the same. We get this crazy Stanley Cup Finals, which is the change part in Montreal, getting the weird COVID year, getting in here, all that good stuff. And then you get the stays the same with Tampa Bay, proving that they were too much for the Habs, and we were able to defend their throne fairly easily in the Stanley Cup Finals. Now, this makes them the most recent team to win NHL titles back-to-back since the 2016 and 2017 Pittsburgh Penguins. So let's take a look at what went in Tampa Bay's favor. The big thing here was Tampa Bay's ability to get more quality looks in the series. Even though there were multiple points where Montreal was out shooting Tampa Bay, they were not getting more looks for the most part. In the first three games, Montreal actually had five goals. Tampa Bay had 14, one of those being an empty net, but six of those came below the face-off spots where you take your face off, and two of those can be attributed to Tyler Johnson having his impressive Game two, no game 3 performance. And, uh, oh yeah, it definitely helped that the Lightning had 17 different players with a point in this series. And, of course, another big thing here was Andre Vasilevsky. He was tested fairly often in Games 1 and 2, and will likely go down with this Game 2 as the defining mark of the series. Montreal outplayed Tampa Bay. However, Vasilevsky stood tall, and Montreal got Vasilevsky as many people started to call it. With that game, they outshot Tampa Bay 43-23. to And, yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, that could have been a great series uh, potential to change the series with Montreal having a 1-1 series tie going into Montreal. Instead, Tampa Bay had a stranglehold going into Quebec with a 2-0 lead, and that is thanks to the Russian goaltender. And finally, while this isn't necessarily all statistical, it just felt like Tampa Bay was able to get quality looks at the right moments. But the important thing is Montreal, for whatever reason, had a horrendous time trying to clear the puck throughout the series. It just seemed like uh, Tampa Bay was able to just get their sticks on it, get the puck to stay in their offensive end, all that good stuff, which led to unfavorably long shifts against a dominant juggernaut of an offensive team, that being the Lightning. So for the Montreal Canadiens, yes, this loss hurts. Hurts bad, I'm sure, and it wasn't competitive in a lot of ways. However, there's some positives to come out of this. You've got the young kids playing on the biggest stage. They got experience from this playoff run. And the next thing is they changed the mindset for the Habs. This is no longer, uh, you know, the mindset of, oh, we haven't made it since 1993 to the Stanley Cup Finals. It's done. That's over with. Now they just have to focus on getting to the top of the mountain and claiming the trophy, whatever that may be, if they get the opportunity with this score. For Tampa Bay won their second straight title, third in franchise history, making them a team that we'll look back at forever as they went to three Stanley Cup Finals in seven years with this group potentially more going forward. However, many will talk about their cap situation being $18 million over the cap. And, you know, the doubters will hungrily look to dethrone the two-time champs in the past two years. And there's expected to be a lot of roster changes to this team next season. Regardless, though, for Bolts fans, please enjoy this moment. You get to claim the cup for another offseason. And, yeah, let me know what your thoughts of this series the whole year. And uh, we'll keep going with hockey content year-round. But for now, we don't have games to talk about until October. But we'll keep up with hockey news in the summer. Anyway, everybody, stay safe. Have a great night. And uh, stay away from COVID already. Oh, also, please make sure to like and subscribe. Goodbye, Brigadiers and Brigadettes. This is your captain signing off. Have a great night.